Zwom Bima. Hello everyone and welcome to another dungeon run in Neverwinter. And we're gonna use the rogue again. She's probably the only one that can survive this one. This one's tough. This is the caverns of Karundax, I believe his name is. Karundax, yes. So without any further delay, let's go show you how crazy dangerous this is. I could go ahead and ride my wolf here. This one is dangerous. See, yeah, I'm going to take on that giant, all those fire creatures. Every single one of them never misses. They catch you on fire, wear down your health. Okay, good times. Here we go. Run around, try to keep out of their way. All right, that didn't hurt too bad. Oh man, you're still here? Okay, good, good, done. So there you go. Karundax is very dangerous. This level, this dungeon, most people underestimate it and then they end up dying and it's really sad. Ah, dodge, dodge. See, they even catch you in their explosions, too. And that explosion opened up a, a hole in the wall there. I guess that's the way we're going. And I cannot invoke right now. I just did a little while ago. Every time you invoke, the next time you can invoke, it, it's uh, longer between times. So the first time it's like 10 minutes, and the next time it's like 20 minutes, and the next time it's... 30 or 40. Oh, hello, everybody. Oh, boy. Man, they can teleport right on top of you. They're trying, they're trying all the, all the stops here. Trying to throw giant chunks of magma on top of me. Oh, yeah, this thing has some crazy boss fights too in it by the way the first one here is a giant she kind of looks like a giant dwarf but I guess it's just a giant giant right open that and am I ready for this am I ready for this yeah I guess I'm ready there she is folks in all her glorious wonder pyrophenia fireband Defeat Pyrophenia. Pyrophenia Fireband. She, she uses a whip. I'm gonna poison her with some lovely flowers. She must have allergies. Dodging, dodging, dodging. She brings out some pretty powerful uh, ads. She's almost done. The ads, see, they're constantly hitting me. Okay, done. Did I get anything cool? No, I guess not. Nothing cool out of that, man. Okay, so... Trip that. These rocks come down. Run right in the middle of all of this. And do do do. Let's run up here. It's like it's halfway finished, or it was finished. There were stairs, and then lava fell over the top of them. Goodness. So if they don't get you with their flames, they try to explode and get you by blowing themselves up right on top of you. It's pretty crazy. Uh, treasure. Cannot, cannot skip treasure. Gotta get the treasure. More of you guys, huh? Yeah. 
Feels like we're making pretty good time. Just by running without using the wolf. Keeps us from going too fast and running into stuff and gives her more time to heal between fights too. So it's kind of a good balance to just run. Man, they just catch you on fire. The residual damage is ridiculous. So yeah, I need the time between fights, so I'm just gonna run like this. All right. Come on, fellas. We really gotta do this. They're kind of too spread out to fight. See, and if you follow them, they leave a trail of fire behind them. So if you try to run up to them as a melee fighter, they uh, you burn yourself. See that? It's pretty smart on their part. But yeah, not smart enough because I'm not going to follow them. I'm just going to throw knives at them. And around the corner and up we go again. And another giant, really. Hmm, I don't remember there being another giant up here. But... No matter. And he's he breathes in, chest goes out, arms go back, and then he starts breathing fire. You can run up next to them and smack them while they're still in in the motion of breathing that fire and that's a good way of doing it okay this is not good this is where there's double levels here so we got to take out these magma creatures what are they called again uh what are their names flame spikers flame spiker yeah then there's these guys magma brutes constantly trying to hit me with giant chunks of magma and then also they, they catch you on fire and they slow you down if you get too close to them. Got him. Not to mention they scream a lot. Okay, up this kind of stairs. Right on the edge of that flame line they make. That's how you do it, right there. Alright, your turn. And you know, I get I get uh there's there's treasure behind here. And I cannot resist the treasure. Okay, so this right here will help me. What do I need? I need a natural skill kit. Okay, do you have a natural skill kit for me, buddy? Come on, please tell me you do. Nature skill kit. I'll get two of them just in case. First one doesn't work. I guess I'll sell some stuff to you while uh, you're here. How you doing? You doing all right? You look happy. You like smiling anyway. Anyway, there we go. That's all I want to give you. I think we're good. We are good. Thanks, man. So cool how he disappears. Now let's open this up. I used a nature kit. Yes, I did. And there's a treasure. Yes, there is. It was worth it. Look at all that good stuff. Oh, man. Love the treasure. Okay, now let's... Go up here, little doorway, which tells me 
giants don't come this way because they would not fit through here. It's a little quieter back here. Let's go on these stairs. Oh yeah, there's a giant. <laughs> I guess he never leaves. Maybe he crouches down, turns sideways to fit through that door occasionally. Go to Subway and get a sandwich or two. Well, not anymore he doesn't. Two treasure chests. Man, you gotta love it. No mimics, though. These are real treasure chests. Uh, oh, well. I kind of like running into mimics because they always have a lot more stuff in them. Try to blow themselves up right on you. Okay. I keep forgetting we're here to take on Karundax, who is a dragon, by the way. I'm about to take on a dragon all by my lonesome. I hope doesn't take too long. We'll see. I'm saving my daily ability just for him. If it cuts him down a little, that would be great. Oh, I can change back. Uh, wait a minute. Oh, don't attack me right now, please. Oh, darn it. Okay. Where was it? Where was my... Oh, there it is. Okay. That thing shoots out a ring of flowers and hurts everybody that has allergy problems. What do these guys think they're doing down here? Cobalts and holes. Look at that, man. They really can hurt you, though. They got me down to a third of health really fast. Getting lulled into a false sense of security. And then all of a sudden, a dragon like that comes out of nowhere. Look, I have that other nature kit. Look at that. I can get treasure that was hidden to look like a dragon egg. What? Where? Oh. Man, you guys just keep falling out of these holes. Is that all of you? Yeah. Alright, up we go. Another boss fight. Look at this. What is his name? Or her. Could be a her. The Hand of Megara. You are the hand of Megira, so there's got to be somebody called Megira. Funny, you're called the hand and you have no hands. Man. Keep moving, keep moving. See, movement is key. Look at that. See, it's hard for them to do the powerful hits on you. I mean, they still hit you with the minor ones no matter what. Unless you actively dodge, you're gonna get hit. But, at least avoiding a lot of these big major attacks. Got him. And he blew himself up for no reason. Okay, well that's good. It's good for us. Treasure. Gotta get it. Got it. Okay, up we go into the giant void of brightness. Look at that. That's beautiful. Here we go. 
Okay, are we ready for this? Yeah, I think we are. Spent all that time going up the mountain. Now we're, it feels like we're going down the other side or something. Or at least running along a ridge, a ridge line at the top of the mountain. Yeah, more like that. We went through a tunnel to get here, and now we're running a ridge line. Whoa, man. Wow. Another giant. Oh, it's not going to fall on me. All right, down we go. Some cobalt down here. Hey guys. One more. Fire elemental. Let's heal up right here really quick. Beyond that gate is a dragon. Several dragons, actually, but the main one is coming back to itself. And we're going in alone. Here we go. Pretty nice entrance, I gotta admit. And I gotta take on these little baby cronies down here. Wow, Karundax from up there tries to shoot me and blow me up. See that? See him shoot that? Yeah, he's trying to blow me up. Not gonna work, bud. At least I hope not, because once he gets you down, it's, it's hard to get back up. And then he'll keep hitting you and hitting you. So I just keep moving. Okay, hey, he looks like he's gonna leave. He only flies up to come back down at another angle. So I'm going to move over here. Oh, there's a treasure box I can't get to yet. I got to beat him first to get it. I hear him. Oh, there he is. Behind him. Perfect. I shall incinerate all of you. Jump. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I made a mistake and used my daily. Uh, used the wrong daily. So now I've got to look out because he's got some little minions that are going to show up. Dodge his wingspan. Yeah, we've got him about fifth. Out. There, there are the cronies. There they are. Stupid dragon worshiping kobolds. You guys, come on, man. Oh, man. Come on, 
fellas. Is he leaving? Yes, he's leaving. Oh my goodness. Okay, good, good, good. See, I almost died there. Okay. Let's heal up. Heal up. I've got a pretty good healing factor. About 15,000 every couple of seconds. Come on. Okay, good. Take on one at a time over here. Oh man, he hit me. There are three of you this time? One down, two to go. Okay, that's it for you guys. Let's see if he's is he angry? He is angry. Is he is he gonna leave? Yes, he's leaving. Good. Okay, he's coming back. He'll be back. Uh, he's coming back over that ridge there. There he is. Best place to be is behind him. Poison him again. Oh, ouch, that hurt. The wingspan flap thing really hurts. The last thing I need are his cronies bothering me, but there they are. I was caught in his roar that time. Might have to use a healing potion here. Oh, I see a crony over there. He keeps hitting me, see? They'll wear you down. Dodge that. It's you and me now, bud. I just keep behind him, but not so close to his tail. Wow, he almost got me. Look at that. I was down to like a, an eighth or a tenth left, but I got him. Awesome. Look at that. Took down a dragon all by my lonesome. That's pretty cool. So there you go. Let's go see what I got for the effort. Please be something good. Please be something good. It's all right, I guess. Okay, so there you go, everyone. Thank you for watching. This has been another Neverwinter dungeon run. The Trickster Rogue taking on Karundax. If you like this kind of thing, go ahead and subscribe. Give me a thumbs up, and uh, hopefully we'll see you in the next one. Thanks so much. Bye.